Hey guys, I'm going to walk you through the Becomes the Master Trophy here in Titanfall 2. Now this is for uh, getting the top three of the Gauntlet scoreboard, and you're going to have to beat 33.65 in order to get the trophy. Now this is my run of 32.10. I'm going to show this to you guys in uh, full speed, and then come back in slow motion, talk you through it. So there you go, 32.10 that earns the becomes the master trophy. Now let's go ahead and take a look at this kind of in slow motion. Now the key to this is keeping your miles per hour up, your average speed or kilometers per hour, I guess, in this game. Now at the very beginning, you gotta jump to the wall. Now I'm gonna jump to the panel. The key to keeping your speed up is to be on these panels. And so I'm gonna jump to the first part of it here before the bend, and then I'm going to jump, and it's gonna actually give me a boost, uh, an acceleration, to the second half. Now I'm going to jump to this center circle thing. Now once I'm up here, I'm going to prepare a grenade. And then it's, I'm using the arc grenades. I'm actually using the EVA 8 auto shotgun as well. So as I'm jumping off, I'm throwing the grenade, aiming for that center guy right there, and then doing a double jump to get me forward. Now at this point, I'm cooking up another arc grenade, tossing it right before the entrance into the next area. We're aiming for the guy on the left. Now there's also two guys on the right. We can only see one, but trust me, there's a second one there. So I'm gonna slide, and I'm actually starting my slide early. For some reason, you can slide from pretty far back and, and helps you keep your speed. So I'm gonna throw another arc grenade right behind that guy against the wall. Took care of two guys, jumping up on the panel here. Again, these are key to keeping your speed up. Now I'm gonna jump over to the left side, but first we have to shoot this guy down here and now I'm going to jump over to the left side, prepare another arc grenade. That's gonna be the last grenade we use. So now that we're here on the left side with the panel, and then I'm gonna throw the grenade and kind of jump back over to the right. And then I'm gonna to have to jump back over to the left. You can't maintain a single wall run very long. Uh, so you're gonna to have to kind of go left and right here. Now, as I'm coming around this corner, I'm shooting that first guy and there's another guy behind him in the distance. We're gonna shoot him before we jump over to the right panel over here. We're gonna to try to get up as high as we can, and we wanna to get to the top corner. As we get to the corner, I'm gonna shoot this guy down here, and then jump up as far as I can, and high as I can on the left panel here. We wanna to try to get as high as you can, and we wanna make the turn around here. Making the corner here is gonna allow us to jump into the final section a little easier. So once I have that, I have a clear line of sight to this panel here. That we're gonna aim for the top one. I'm actually gonna be a little high, but that's okay. Now you're gonna see it kind of bends around to the right there and comes back. Before the bend, we're gonna to jump towards the middle and with our EVA 8 shotgun, shoot the guy in the middle. And as we're falling, use our double jump boost to get back over to the right. Once on the wall, shoot this last guy right here. Now we're gonna use a set of double jumps to get to the finish. So we're gonna jump, and then as we get kinda of to the bottom of our jump, we're gonna jump again and give us a little push forward, allow us to cross the finish line in 32.10 seconds. It's not easy, guys. It took me a lot of practice to kinda of figure out the best route for me. And uh, it's gonna take you, I mean, unless you're really, really good at games, it's gonna take you a little while to get it. It sucks, to be honest with you. But once you get the hang of it, it becomes much easier. So thanks for watching, guys. Please like, comment, and of course, subscribe.